Today's video, I am showcasing Nissa. It's just a fun deck that I put together. It's not meant to be competitive in any way, but I just like the idea of a bunch of board wipes with Wizards class, kind of like why I like the Jace deck so much. So the deck is playing the Portal, just to give you some more threat density. I'm playing School of the Wizard, because with uh, Elemental Mastery, I want to get off the 5-5 Sneaks by playing the Second Sun's Dawn, the Day of Judgment, and the Lava Wave. So we're just playing a bunch of board wipes and then trying to play 5-5s five with Sneak afterwards. We have the Birds of Paradise just to help us ramp to these big spells. Uh, we have Scion because it's just honestly one of the best early creatures that you can play and if there's any hole in your curve it can fill it. And then it has Ward so it's a guaranteed blocker. We have the Rampant Growth to help you get to the board wipes faster. Tusker is just a good um, good creature early, just got a bunch of stats, helps you block, helps you get aggressive. Giant growth to combat other giant grows, help you stay on the board longer to get to the later game. Elvish Infuser, same thing. Just an early blocker, helps you stay in the game longer. The Druid card uh, is like some of the only draw power in the deck. So whenever you gain a mana gem that's not from your land, so that you um, draw a card. So Birds of Paradise triggers this. Rampant Growth triggers this, and that's really all I need. I didn't want to go super hard in on a ramp package because the meta is very fast and there's a lot of really strong mid-range decks. And so taking out a turn to play like a Shrine or something, you're probably just going to die. I play the Soul of the Wood, helps you stabilize, um, blocks the Flyers, heals you for three so it gets you out of the reach of some burn cards if you're playing against like a Chandra. So the Stag is another card to just help clear up because we don't have a lot of removal outside of the board wipes. And you can hit a lot of legendary creatures against Ritz with the Stag. I'm playing, I'm testing the two Ejected just because again, there's not a lot of spot removal and I just wanted something else. I'm not sold on it. I was just testing it out. And also with the Familiar decreasing its cost by two, it could be pretty decent. Second Sun's Dawn, you heal yourself for seven, put Second Sun into the deck. So both of these will trigger the Elemental Mastery, and this is an alternate win con. And then also Familiar making this cost four is never uh, that bad. Day of Judgment, we all know it's just the um, classic board wipe. And then again, Familiar can make it cost five, and it will also trigger Mastery if it's at its normal cost. Brawling Behemoth is just some more removal because again we don't have a lot of spot removal and just another way to fight for the board lava wave is uh one-sided removal and will also trigger mastery so you get to keep your board and you add a 5-5 five -five with sneak late game so it's very strong and then we also have the crusher worms as another win con to just um try and make an unbreakable board pretty much or your opponent has to dump so many resources into it that you know it's just such a bonus so that's the deck guys, I hope you enjoy the video, and thank you for watching. Alright, let's see if this kooky deck can actually get a win here. Okay, so Lava Wave and Day of Judgment are excellent against a Johnny, so hopefully the deck does exactly what I want it to do. We have a little bit of ramp, and the cost reduction on the familiar could make it really nice. Um, two, three, four, it's a little late, um, okay, Rampant Growth's good. I think I have stage fright. Have confidence in yourself. <laughs> huh. Seek knowledge. Yeah, and if the bird makes this cost nothing, that'd be fantastic. Oh man, I did not mean to put refreshment stand in. I meant to put it in portal. Stand back, That's embarrassing. Everyone. And that uh, could end up being pretty good, so. Let's do this. Excellent. 
That's fine, because Stag's gonna take that out. I got this! <laughs> Completely fine with me. Right, let's take care of this while I can. I got this! And then we've got some decent stats along with some draw power slash ramp. Yeah. Don't see a reason to keep it around. Excellent. Hmm. Yeah, I still think it's this. Next turn I can drop this and this, and ramp if I don't draw another spell, so that'll be pretty good. Aww. I think I can get more value out of my bird than uh, blocking for four. <laughs> Man, I can't believe I don't have Yawning Portal and I put in Refreshment Stand by accident. Uh, hopefully it doesn't bite me, he didn't get like the nuts off of it. You're just gonna kill my bird. I, I knew he couldn't resist. Excellent. Alright, then yes, I think this is the play. A fellow seeker. Feels like home. Huh. Life is for the living. I'm gonna give it to itself so I can have a block against this. Hmm. That's that's unfortunate. This land is crazy. I know I say that all the time, but it really, really is. I'm really glad I have this in my hand right now. Life is for the living. Uh -huh. Excellent. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Just making sure there's no Please giant growth see. there. Now Excellent. lava wave and Day judgment would be very appreciated. Okay, so I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna poke him for one. And hopefully I get some good value off of this card. Still have all judgments and all lava waves in the deck. Uh, all together. Practice makes perfect. Hmm. I thought he would put that Excellent. in the deck and just pick off my board. Yeah. Okay, he hasn't had it all game, but that doesn't mean anything. Let's do this yeah. first. Oh, my own crap is going to trigger. I'm such an idiot. But that's fine. It's a 4-1. I don't hate it. Um, Let's go 3, and then I'm going to let that hit me. Okay, now this is... This is mop up time, right? It's actually kind of nice that my bird is a 4 1 flyer now. Like that combined with this flyer might not be too bad. So. Life is for the living. Excellent. And hopefully it doesn't give it to itself. That's fine. Excellent. Now, if these two can get a trade off, that would be. Really nice. My land 
I hope he attacks. Wow, okay. So he's misplaying as well. Standing down. Um, yep. Yeah, we're just cleaning this up. Okay. Fantastic. Okay, despite the egregious misplays, we are somehow in this still. Alright. The misplays being um, trigger my own growth and accidentally putting this in my deck instead of um, portal. Good morning, little friends. Excellent. This card's so crazy. Okay, so. Three and seven, last time I checked, still make ten, so I don't see a reason why I wouldn't just go ahead and hit him for seven. And then try and get the trade next turn. And then Crusher Worms should really help. Always does against mid-range. So, attack. And I hope he just concedes after this. I really hope he just concedes. Alright, didn't get the concession. Let's gear up. Okay, I kinda understand why now. Turn the stone would be fantastic here. Even if he gives this flying, I can at least block it once. Well, I'm going to block Excellent. with the 6 first, and then see if this guarantee goes. Yeah, that is so fine with me. Yeah, no issue with that whatsoever. Okay, we're getting close to him running out of gas. As I say that, he drops two 8-9 Tarmogoyfs. I really need this to be good. Well, Balance wasn't bad. Potential. Let's the do this. Me. I can at least trade in with this one. And I'm gonna drag under the one that is 8-9. Love it. Let's gear up. The top decks. Alright, I still have Day of Judgments and Lava Waves in my deck. So I really hope that, that uh, I get those soon and I can just clean up. And now I'm gonna have to drag Excellent. under probably something with Flying or like Relentless. Okay, so we just made more threats. Don't know why he's swinging with this one, but... I'll take that for sure, for sure. Um, yeah, I'll take this. Um, I'll take eight, and I'm gonna drag under, and then I have blockers for these two. Sucks I can't do both, right? But, that's okay. The sky calls. Lava Way finally came in clutch, though. Alright, now we're just gonna play with another creature, and hopefully top deck's a creature and I just drag under and swing for game, right? Woo! Alright, excuse the horrible block with the... Thank you for the uh, fight, my friend. ...familiar... ...trigger in my own growth. Alright, so we have the right land in the deck now. So, hopefully it performs well. Okay, so against Dritz, I'm really leaning on the Lava Wave and the Day of Judgment, which is just kind of the plan against all the big mid-range strats, right? Okay, there's a Day of Judgment, there's an Infuser, there's a Giant Growth. I think I just keep it, right? These two will allow me to You've fight for the board fight. probably up to like turn four. Well, then, let events take their course. 
And if this is the only spell I draw, the familiar will make it cost five, which is really strong. Okay, so I might even just yeah. drop the familiar immediately, and then with growth I'll have a 4-4 flyer. As we know from the previous game. Interesting. Well, plans change. If he attacks with the just it, then I'll just take it because I want to be able to arm my own growth, right? Wait for an opportunity. Yeah, you still have to pass. Okay, I'm um, not sure what just happened. But I will, I will certainly take it, right? Alright, so... I will infuse her and try and keep this thing alive. Just gonna try and build a wall of creatures, and that should get it done. Okay, I think he's salty. Oh no, that's worms. That's worms. Please concede. So if I'm gonna stick true to my plan, then these two work. Worms wake. Yep, yep. And this is the part where he gets really mad. He just wants to see what. Okay, I thought he just wanted to see what happens, but he's also doing this as well. But this is fine. This allows either one of my creatures to trade into the worm. So that's okay. Yeah. That's really funny. So we're gonna do this. seeker. I'm going to attack. If he, if I can trade with the wolf, that's totally fine with me. Okay, and now I'm going to. Am I gonna giant growth? Because this is gonna die to anything. I mean, unless he giant growths too. So I'd rather just guarantee get it off the board. He could have like any buff for this to get past um, these creatures. So I think this is just the safer play. Wait for yeah. an opportunity. Um. Yeah, this would do it. And now we're almost out of cards, unfortunately. Please concede. Okay. Life is for the living. Mm -mm -mm. My blade protects all okay, the world. My shadow. Please concede. Like it sucks that it's gonna come. It might come back at some point, but for the boros. I'm not gonna day a judgment this board. Please concede. Is that the land going off? Man. Deep Forest Arena is... It's gotta be one of the best lands. Okay. This is Day of Judgment coming in clutch here. Now, since I know I'm gonna Day of Judgment, then I might as well just... Please concede. Take as little damage as possible. Oh, a ramp. Ramp artifact. That's good. Shall we? Okay, I'm really glad he played that. Mm. Okay, that's not terrible. I'm gonna see what he does. He might just take it. Okay. Just don't top the Tajik and put back in. Pretty please. Especially with that going off again. Man, Deep Sea, uh, Deep Sea, Deep Forest Arena is... 
Such a such a such a good deck. Well, guys, I've taken enough punishment with Nissa for the day. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you tomorrow. Huh? Uh